What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jay. And uh, I got a little announcement, man. I woke up early this morning and I went into a dentist appointment. And uh, let's just say I don't look like a fucking meth head no more. <laughs> oh my god. It feels so weird. It feels so weird to be able to actually smile. So. Yeah, so I'm going to give you guys a little uh, back history on how this all happened. So when I was 14 years old, um, I broke off my front tooth. I'm still having trouble trying to talk. It feels so weird. I'm like slurring my words and stuff. But I, uh, when, I was, when I was real young, me and my family didn't have a lot of money. We had, like, close to no money. We were really poor. And uh, I always lived in, like, these run-down trailers. A lot of times we didn't have electricity. A lot of times we didn't have food. And from the time I was 11 years old to the time I was 16, we lived in this single wide that was way up on this hill. We used to call it the mountain. And uh, the entire time we lived there, we never had running water. So, uh, you know... My dental hygiene just kind of went downhill. Um, but yeah, I broke my tooth off when I was when I was 14. And uh, we just never actually had the money. I never had health insurance or dental insurance, nothing like that growing up. So it just kind of got worse. And then eventually my tooth was completely gone. And I've basically been living my entire life without my front tooth since I was 14. And, um, I just recently got engaged last summer, and, uh, me and my fiance, we decided we were going to put into work now that I have a good job, I make pretty good money, and I have good health insurance and dental insurance, that we were going to try really hard to get my front teeth fixed. So, I had to get you know, a couple cavities taken care of. I had to get my wisdoms pulled out. And then I had to get a root canal. And then I had to get the one tooth I had right here that was broken off, I had to get that pulled out. So, like, the last eight months, I have been in and out of dentist office non-stop. Like, three different places. Going in, getting root canals, getting teeth pulled, just going through so much crazy shit. And, uh... I talked to him about what I wanted to do, and I wasn't really comfortable having dentures. I told him I wanted something that was permanent. I didn't want to be the guy that takes his teeth out every night and goes to sleep. Like, I want something permanent. I want it to feel real just because I've never been able to have, like, real teeth. So they told me what the price was, and I knew it was way out of my, you know, <laughs> way out of my price range. But at the same time, it's something I've always wanted to do. So I saved up the money with some help from my fiance and my fiance's friend and a few other people that's backed me up on this and kind of pushed me to do it. I told him I wanted to get the procedure done and I went in today. And uh, from 7.30 this morning to about 11.30, 12 o'clock this afternoon, they were working on me. And uh, now I have teeth. <laughs> it feels so weird. But it's going to be cool, man, because, like, now I don't have to live my life with people constantly mistaking me for a meth head. <laughs> so, I mean, that's an advantage out the gate. <laughs> I'm so, so excited. It's been an emotional morning, man. I'm not usually the type of guy that gets emotional over stuff like this. And I didn't really get too emotional in the dentist's office. But when I got in my car, I'm not going to lie to you guys, man. I teared up. And I was looking in the mirror at a guy that I've never seen since he was a little kid. So it's like, it's crazy, man. It's crazy. But I just want to share that with you because that's, uh, it's just, man, it's something I never thought was going to happen for me. But uh, here I am with some new teeth. It's wild, man. So, you know. I'm still your hillbilly Jay, man. I'm just a better fucking version of him. I'm a better looking guy, man. <laughs> um, I love you.
love you guys, and you guys are always supporting me no matter what I do in every situation, do every aspect. So I wanted to share this with you guys because this was a, a big deal for me. But, uh, yeah, man, your boy's got a new grill. <laughs> now I got to start kicking these things, man. I can't be smoking no more, no more vaping. I'm probably going to stop after this one. I am. I'm going to stop after this one's done so that way I don't ruin my new teeth. But, uh, yeah, I want to share that with you guys, man. I love you, and, uh, you know, you guys helped make this possible, so I really appreciate it. But y'all have a good night. <laughs> hey.